I'm Tom Wassink. I am the medical director of one of the adult psychiatry inpatient units at the University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics. I've been a psychiatrist here at the university uh, for more than 25 years, caring for patients with chronic and persistent mental illness. And we, speaking on behalf of our whole department, we are super grateful to the Outreach Patient Clothing Program from St. Andrew Presbyterian Church because uh, it meets a need for our patients that's not met in any other way. And so being able to provide clothing from this program for our patients uh, is a gift. And we are a hospital that serves people with chronic and persistent mental illness. And oftentimes the patients we serve are uninsured or underinsured. They're also often in just a difficult transition, meaning an unexpected transition in life. They may be coming from one setting into our hospital and then discharged into a different setting. Uh, they often too just don't have much help out there in the big wide world. So it means sometimes they don't have many possessions to begin with. Sometimes they're taking their possessions with them through the period of transition is difficult because they don't have help. So we oftentimes have people, you know, have a variety of needs, but one of them is clothing and clothing is, is it's one of the, one of the needs that's not met in a systematic way. And so it's a place where very specific targeted need meeting this need from the community is super helpful for people. We don't have a huge number of people, but they're high need people. Yeah. One of the things that we struggle with is that the population we care for is often unperceived in the broader community because many of these people can't speak for themselves. They can't advocate well for themselves. Um, and so they get hidden in our system. Uh, and 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 truthfully, our place, the psychiatry inpatient unit at the University of Iowa Hospital, it too is often not on people's radar as a place of need where you would make a donation to. Um, but we don't have another source of clothing. We don't have a line of funding for it that we care for them deeply. It's an amazing group of people working to care for these patients. And so when we find other people who who care for them also, or who realize, oh, we should put effort towards caring for these people. That's, that's a good thing.